In life, we all have dreams, but it's how far we'll go to make them come true. Millions across the world dream of making it to the NBA. Only 60 get drafted every year. Emmanuel quickly joins the small group blessed to hear their name called an NBA draft. He's just the second to do it from Havery to Grace. He is walking in his purpose. Really looking forward to that day uh, where my name gets called. You know, all the hard work, whether it's you know on a stage or whether it's you know over a Zoom call or over, over an internet call, I'm really looking forward to the opportunity just to hear my name called to be able to celebrate it with all the people that have you know put a lot of time and, and hours with me. She just got real. Yeah. Man, what's she screaming about? She think I'm going number one. <laughs> be quiet, y'all, be quiet. That way we actually to continue what God to watch over still and protect us. Emmanuel quickly comes from a great family, a loving family, family where grandfathers, aunts, uncles, cousins. Um, there's more love that goes around that room than anywhere else you'll find in this country. When the Quickly's get together, it is time to eat, fellowship, and have wonderful memories of who did what, and remember this time, and remember that time. Um, my mom always cooks the big Sunday dinner, and we spend time together um, laughing. My family has been there every step of the way. Um, they have been tireless um, servants who have stuck by Emmanuel and supported him in all of his endeavors, um, in all of his practices, and all of his heartaches, and all of his pains. They've been there with him. Manny got the ball with about 13 seconds left. They was down two, cut it loose, three points. Miss Edie said, I ain't calling no time I am elated that we are going to be able to travel to New York together and celebrate with Emmanuel as he begins the next journey of his life. A dream that he has had since he was in the fifth grade. He told me he was going to play in the NBA. So New York, here we come. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited! Draft day, baby. I'm back alive. Mm -hmm. Many people, you know, make it from Hattie Grace Pro level, so uh, hoping to just be able to, you know, make it, go far with it, and you know, give back to others, so you know, other people can make it from my station. That's the money man in the chair right there. Yeah, I should have a, a nice little fit tonight. Uh, Indochino looking out, so I got some. Something a little sticky coming. Got some a little bit of custom shoes. Too, so that's, cool. that's all good though, you feel me? Uh, get this money today, got a first cut, you feel me? Appreciate it. Well, bro. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. What's up, baby? Rice right, boo? Sorry. I don't need no stylus. You don't need no stylus? I don't need no stylus. Hey, so you're gonna have dress like this from now on. Everywhere you go, you guys dress like this. Yeah, I was at Romans 828. Know that all things work together for the good of those that love God and are called according to His purpose. You know, this is big. This is what kids dream about right here, man. Right. The man over here, fresh to death, man. He out here. I feel like I feel like I just want to be in my suit for the rest of the night. I'm kind of feeling this. Big box. Yo, is it me or, or do you just want to get out of this so you can just put it back on later? How you feeling, nice son? Man, you know I'm feeling good, man. You know. I really, really be out here in a few hours. Uh, you know, I got the suit looking good. You know, shoes, everything, tough and that. Yes, sir. Yeah, I like this dog. You feel me? I'm feeling this dog I mean, myself. I mean, I mean, they know about me. Uh, Y'all feel me? So, you know, we just, we just gonna enjoy your suit real quick. You feel me? I'm digging the gray. I'm digging the tone neck. You feel me? My man Isaiah, coming to you live. Appreciate you. It's been a great day. Got the people I care about the most with me. So, my mom, you know, my aunt, you know. Got a couple of my coaches. Fellas, it's a big dragon tonight, you feel me? <laughs> yes, sir. Okay, I see y'all then. Let's go quickly. Let's go, baby boy. My grandparents, so. little sis, big sis, uh, my uncle, so. You know, it's a great day just, you know, sharing it with some great people, so. I'm really blessed. Oh, boy, there's a shop over there. You feel me? <laughs> 
<laughs> Boy. This just got worse. You should think I'm going number one. <laughs> You know, that African proverb, it takes a village to raise just one child, um, is so true. Family. So long, you wish you could share the experience with everybody alive, but this is the best we can do. All of his teachers, his trainers, um, his coaches, they've all played a part. The Quickly family, um, the Hamilton family, the Caldwell family have all been there to support Emmanuel, to help nurture him, and to help provide him with guidance. Oh, What's good, those, bro? That was, that was, that was hey, bro, good. I almost didn't answer the phone, bro. My mom did pick up the phone, but I'll let you play your big day. No doubt. No doubt, bro. That is my godson, uh, Raiden. It's really amazing. They grew up spending the summers together. Hey, hey it, started, it started off with, who will go for a walk? <laughs> I'm like, 3 o'clock in the morning, I'm going to sleep. I'm going to get a butt woman. I don't think we had no money, bro. Raiden is, um, he's locked up right now. But we're keeping him encouraged and we're letting him know as long as there's life, there's hope. And we love him. Just the beginning, dog. So good, man. I'm so proud of you, dog. Love you, man. Love you, too. Everybody. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I said that's our guy. I'm super excited, but I'm nervous at the same time. Like I can only imagine how he feels. Like, and I'm not even getting dressed. Uh, you know, just waiting for the pick to come. You know, yeah. looking good. Look like you know he might go to 23 uh, with the Knicks. So we just hoping nothing happen. Uh, the next day move, but that's what it's looking like right now. But anything could happen. Anybody could pick him before that. You never know. It's a draft. Drive, Precious Drive, RJ Hampton's still on the board. Yeah. Great hands, great hands. Woo! Oh, no, 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 My mom and dad have been such a support to Emmanuel. My big brother, Sean, made sure that everything was okay. My daughters, they are such wonderful young, young ladies. And they love their brother, Emmanuel and Aunt Michi. Hung out down through the years. At one time, Michi was staying with us. And it's just an unbelievable, Bond that they formed. Emmanuel Quickly was blessed to hear his name called as the 25th pick of the 2020 NBA Draft. It's unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. 
if, if, if y'all was in my shoes, you, you wouldn't even know how I made it, but God made a way. So that's all I really got to say. I appreciate everybody, man. Everybody, and I mean that. It's so crazy, y'all. We nicks. We nicker bobbers, baby. It's been a journey, starting from Havre de Grace to Kentucky. I'm happy Grace not going to the Knicks, bro. Like, it's just not happening. Man, this is crazy. Sam! Appreciate you, man. Of course. Me too. Me too. Awesome. Woo! No doubt. Man, I'm trying to get in the gym. What's, what's happening, man? Tell my move. We're trying to get in the gym, man. Following you around. A, I can follow you around. It's a movie. And now he's a New York Knicks. No, oh, we yeah, baby. Hey, we gotta we gotta play some Marvin Snap or something. We gotta get some guys real quick, real quick, one time, one time. With the help of family, friends, and trainers, he's had aid get into this point. Now it's time for his game to do the talking. Emmanuel is walking in his purpose. <laughs> 